Feels like a diary. All right, boys and girls, welcome to episode 12 of Lock G Season 3, an episode that we didn't know at the beginning of the season that we were going to have, but here we are, boys and girls. We have qualified for the playoffs, that's the tournament, an extra three games possibly, and then who knows after that, if you win those, you could potentially go on to nationals, but got to take it one game at a time, and today is the call to final. We are going up against the team that beat us 2-0 last Saturday, William Woods. It's the flip, it's the reverse, and we're playing at home, definitely backing us to win this and it's going to be very enjoyable to go out there today and play for a spot in the semi-final against who knows who. All three other games in the league are being played before ours, so we're actually going to know who's made it to the other semi-finals and who we will face if we beat William Woods tonight. We've got to focus on ourselves, make sure that we win this quarter-final and um, put in a big performance. Currently it's around 10 degrees Celsius, that's why I'm in this big fluffy polar bear jumper somebody said they were interested where to get this i just got it off the nike website i got a bit lucky um don't know if they're still up there i'm gonna go for a little bit of a walk later i might buy a lottery ticket for the millions that are currently on offer in america it's like a billion up for grabs so i might grab one of them because you never know don't buy a ticket you won't win the raffle but the rest of the day is pretty standard at 3 p.m i'm gonna have my pre-match meal switching it up today boys because i'm not gonna lie viviano's hasn't been agreeing with me on a uh, on a personal level so my game plan have mine cycle to the game a couple little snacks whilst everyone else is having their pasta and such and then when it comes to game time obviously caffeinated gel 30 minutes before a little snack at half time you know the drill guys stay hydrated gonna be a big one 7 p.m kickoff under the lights looking forward to it it is gonna be chilly though so gonna make sure that i bring on my layers but yeah let's get on with the day Come on the boys, what a big day it's gonna be. It's about midday, just thought I'd get out of the house um, and gone for a walk down the road, about 10, 15 minutes down the road to the 7-Eleven. So we're gonna buy some lotto tickets. Cause I'm gonna be a millionaire, Rodney. Get a bit of fresh air. Being cooped up in a house isn't good for your psyche, for your mental, especially when it's the 7 p.m. kickoff. You wanna be getting out. So uh, yeah, get some lotto tickets, winning numbers, yes sir. Currently, just getting everything ready. Like normal, GPS first, caffeine gel. I'll take 30 minutes before I kick off. Tape for my finger, um, the one that I think I might have broken. Grip socks from Maestro, you know the deal guys. Best grip socks in the game, most affordable as well. If you use the code LOTG10 down below, you can get yourself a pair. But if you can't or don't need grip socks right now, just go and follow them on Instagram. Check them out, they do great stuff. Um, and they've also made these gloves, uh, Maestro gloves that are coming back because we're getting into the cold season now. So if you want to get yourself a pair of gloves or a pair of socks, check them out. It's going to be a cold one. Got my Under Armour. Sort of just going about the normal business. It's coming up to quarter past two. Very excited. Sort of bubbling up a bit now. That's way too early, so I need to settle down. I'll uh, show you when I've cooked scrambled eggs and um, then we'll be on the way. Fresh trims everywhere. <laughs> We've had the film session, quite a long film session, just going through the film of the game that we played against them the other day, because obviously we literally played them last Saturday, so it's going to be fresh in our minds, just going through and uh, making sure we know what we're talking about there. But now we've got like an hour or so until we need to be ready, just out on the pitch. A few of us out here just sort of relaxing, getting some fresh air, but yeah, just trying to visualise for the game. And uh, then we'll be going in, getting ready, then it's game time, boys. So. Um, yeah, trying to get some fresh air, get the mind right, get the mind set for the game. Come on, the boys. Come on, Griff. Yep. Come on, come on, Sean. Good luck, mate. Good luck, Good luck boys. Good luck, fellas. Good luck, boys. Let's go. Always positive, boys. Always positive. Come on. Slow down, three. One, two, three. Five. Come on, boys. Hey, let's go. And a warm welcome to you on this lovely Saturday night. Here from Spartan Field, it's the AMC Men's Soccer quarterfinals between the three-seeded Missouri Baptist Spartans and the six-seeded William Woods Owls. Now Perez with it, got a little bit of space, now runs it on to Dordovich, taking a shot and gets it in the near post. Marco, Marco Dordovich opens up his gear, fist pumps to the crowd. Player. Lining it up, aiming for that bottom corner and it's, it's safe, safe, safe from a dangerous spot. Great spot for 
The left footer, but they take it quickly. It's Ruane. Now they trip it. And diving header coming from Dordovich. From Encino. Back and forth. Good one, too. And it's on for Encino. He's got the goalkeeper to beat and just can't do it. Stepping out and getting to it was Gonzalez. And it's Burton who was subbed in. Crossing it for Ruane. Good ball into Wilson. Gets ahead on it. Bit of confusion now. Not sure what's going on. Uh, we will see a yellow card, and I think we've got a penalty. And Dordovich, a chance to double his tally. Shot comes in low to the right, and Marco has doubled the lead for Missouri Baptist. And is holding on to it at the minute. And we're going to call it a stop there. see two yellow cards, both going to William Wood's players, and now we see a red card, they're trying to get a shot off, it's bouncing around just outside the box, and it's Wayne who's got an opportunity, it's just him and the goalkeeper, he's going to look to loft it into the net, and it's a goal, Joe Ruane makes it three. Number 10, Joe Ruane. And the Spartans have done it. They're moving on to the semifinals of the Ameri American Midwest Conference. Come on! Yeah! Okay, now. Yes! Yes! Nico! Good game, boys. Good game, Good game, me. Yeah. Well played. Way move, way move. One kiss is all it takes. Fall in love with it. Possibility. Love it. 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 Obviously, you've seen the game. We won 3-0. Great result. Really solid performance. Didn't really give them a sniff in the game. Um, that's how the first game during the season should have gone, but it didn't. Even leading up to the game, there wasn't a doubt in my head um, that we were going to come through and get the result. I think the boys played really well, showed great energy. Time to get a lot of rest, a lot of recovery, because a two-day, three-day turnaround is pretty mental. But that's going to be it for today's episode. If you've enjoyed it make sure you hit that like button make sure you subscribe because the semi-final is coming next weekend boys be prepared be ready for it because it's going to be a blast see you in the next one remember do it for the love of the game peace